What's up guys, Mitchell Watts with Town & Country TV and today we are talking about the best lift kits you can currently get on your new 2021 and 2022 Ford Bronco. Before we jump into the video though, I've got some very exciting news, so let's check it out. Well, I didn't think we were going to do this, but we are going to change the Bronco giveaway. So I know what we said. We said that the day that we hit 300,000 subscribers on YouTube, we would launch the giveaway of this vehicle but we've decided to go ahead and bump it up. So starting right now, by the time that you guys are seeing this video, that every single dollar spent on tccustoms.com towards merch will get you an automatic extra entry into the giveaway. And so, yes, I, I'm aware that we said we were gonna wait until 300,000 subscribers, but we felt like that was wrong. We wanted to go ahead and bump it up so that way we can go ahead and get you guys launched on this giveaway. So we've got awesome shirts, as you can see right here. Uh, yeah, I actually didn't even think about <laughs> I know a lot of you guys have been asking for a six foot three shirt. We've got lots of different styles, really, really high premium quality stuff. Just go ahead and check out tccustoms.com. Look at all the different merchandise. And once again, every dollar spent gets you an automatic extra entry into the giveaway. So now let's get back to the video. All right, so first up, let's take a look at this vehicle. This is my personal 2021 Ford Bronco Badlands. It's completely bone stock. And we're gonna show you uh, and talk about this here in just a second, about some of the suspension that is available for vehicles vehicles that are just like this. But what I want to do is talk about this vehicle. This is a uh, big bend Ford Bronco and it's got some suspension modifications. So I've actually brought in one of our resident experts, Mr. Nathan Harmon with TC Customs. Now this is the first time you guys have seen Nathan on our YouTube channel, but he has, he's not a rookie. He's been with us for quite some time. Uh, and if you call into the dealership, you're more than likely going to either talk to him or Colton. Uh, so with that being said, talk to us about what suspension is on this, the pros, the cons, and just the details in general about the suspension modifications we've done to this Bronco. Yeah, absolutely. So on this one, we've got the zone two inch lift kit. Um, so it gives you two inches of lift in the front and one inch of lift in the rear. So it does keep it totally level. It does allow clearance. As you can see on this one, we do have 35 inch by 1250 tires. So it is giving you a lot bigger tire that you can fit in there. We did have to remove crash bars uh, in order for this to work, but you can fit 35s on this lift kit. Um, it's pretty simple design. It's just a spacer kit that goes on top of the strut towers to give you that lift. So it's not a complete overall suspension rework. It's not replacing your coils. It's not replacing your suspension components. It's just adding a lift to it. Um, so the pros is that it works with a lot of the Bronco models. Um, so as long as if you've got anything that doesn't have a uh, Badlands suspension or a uh, Sasquatch suspension, this will work with. Now, if you do have Badlands or Sasquatch, we will have to look at some other options, which we do have available. Very good. So uh, there you go. That That is, uh, let me ask you, is this one of the more budget friendly versions? Yeah, absolutely. This kit runs um, about a hundred bucks for the parts. So okay. it is very budget friendly. Okay, very cool. And I think we've actually got a promo code going on for this particular, this specific kit. Uh, so if I can find that promo code, we'll put that right there on the screen. So um, any other details on this particular lift kit that people need to know? No, I don't think so. I mean, it's, it's pretty simple, okay. pretty basic. Okay, easy enough. So let's do that. Uh, move on to the next vehicle, which is going to be this <laughs> this thing is nasty. I'll yeah. tell you, uh, this is kind of your baby. Uh, he's actually the one that kind of designed what we did and why we did and all of the specific aspects of this vehicle. This is his baby. So as far as suspension work, I know there's a lot of other things going on in the vehicle. And if you want to see that video, click on the link up in the cards to see that specifically. But Talking about suspension specifically, what would you recommend or what do you what's going on here? Yeah, so this is the Rough Country three and a half inch lift kit. Um, so this one is a little bit different in terms of what the zone two inch does. So this does give you some spacers to, to help raise it up, but also it gives you new upper control arms uh, to make sure that your articulation, you do get a little bit more reach with that. You do have a little bit more suspension travel with that. It's not, you know, maxing out your struts and the factory upper control arm is not quite as big. So it's not going to give you as much travel as, as this will. With the three and a half inch lift, we were able to fit 37s. So, I mean, you know, we only went up half an inch from this one, but it looks so much bigger because of those tires. Uh, so, you know, if you if you really want to step up in, in tire size, we do have this Rough Country three and a half inch kit available. Um, the cool thing about this one, too, is it does come with a uh, little drop bracket for the drivetrain on the front. So that way your CV angles are more in line. It's, it's not getting that all out of whack. So that way all of your geometry is is more or less where it's supposed to be. Um, and this kit is 
it's still an affordable kit, I would say. Um, you know, three and a half inch lift lift. It is giving you our three and a half inches all around. So it's not totally level. There is going to still be a slight rake like there is from factory. So it's not like the zone where it's kind of a staggered setup. This is three and a half all the way around. We did have to remove again crash bars on this to get the, the 37s in there, but we are fitting them with no problems. It's not rubbing uh, with this particular wheel setup. Uh, and I think this kit runs about $600 just for the parts. Okay. Still very, very affordable. So uh, above that, we don't actually have an example of that just yet, but I, my understanding is Zone Off-Road has even more kits that they have just developed that are available for the Bronco. Um, I know there's a lot of different variations, uh, whether it's a two-door or a four-door, whether it's a Sasquatch, non-Sasquatch. Uh, so we're not looking for any specific details there, but in general, what are the other zone off-road lift kits that they are offering? Once again, not equipped on this yeah. vehicle that are, I think there's, and also talk about the shipping dates because I'm not 100% up to speed with when those things are going to be shipping. Well, on shipping dates, I'm not 100% up to speed on that either. Uh, we are waiting to hear back from Zone on that. They have them listed on their site as in stock, so we have them on order. So hopefully we'll be seeing those very soon. They do have a three and a four inch kit available. So the three inch kit works on Sasquatch models. Um, and then the four inch works on base shock components. So again, they still haven't released one for the Badlands yet. Um, they will have those coming, but the three inch is for any model with Sasquatch, and then the four inch is for anything other than Badlands. Okay, what is what is factored inside of that, that kit? Like what is it, uh, how does it achieve that? I mean, is it just a strut space or what's in the kit? Uh, it's very similar to the Rough Country kit in terms of its design. It does have uh, strut spacers and new upper control arms. Okay. Um, it does not have a drop bracket for the CV angles, you know, like the Rough Country does, but it does have the spacers for the struts. Um, and, it, and again, just like on the two inch kit, it does level out the vehicle. So that three inch kit is going to be three in the front, two in the rear. Four inch kit is going to be four in the front, three in the rear. Okay, very cool. Well, that's uh, that's good information about that. Now, if a customer has something like this, like what I've got, which is a Badlands, my, uh, my understanding is that a lot of the suspension components once again, we'll find out a lot more. We're, if, for those of you guys that are curious, we're actually making this video on October 29th, and so we're actually leaving out to go to SEMA next week, and there's going to be a lot of brand new lift kits that are unveiled at that time, so we're probably probably a terrible time to make this video <laughs> right before they unveil a whole lot of lift kits, but this is what's available as of October 29th. Um, but right now, my understanding is that BDS just announced one of their mini lift kits that they've got uh, available on the 2021 Bronco. And if it's okay, I'll talk a little bit about this and yeah. you can kind of correct me or if you have something to share about that. Well, I was gonna say also, Zone does have one that they have announced for the Badlands. It's just not out yet. It is a three and a half inch lift. So it's gonna be the same design as the, the three and four inch that's for the other suspension systems. Wow. But they will have it for it. It's just not available yet. And those all those zone kits do fit 37s. That is interesting news. I didn't realize that the zone kit would actually fit the Badlands. So that is that is good information. They will have one specifically for it. That is that is awesome. So good stuff there. So as far as what BDS offers, and by the way, if you guys don't know, Zone Off-Road and BDS are owned by the same parent company, which is Fox Holdings, Fox Racing Shocks, which brings me to what BDS has to currently offer. Now, they've got a couple of different lift kits that have not been announced. They they have announced they're going to go all the way up to a six and a half inch lift kit. But what they just debuted on their website yesterday, late last night, was a three and a half inch, well, it depends on what vehicle it is, but specifically for a Badlands, it gives you three and a half inches of lift and it is a DSC coilover system for the front and the rear. So it is a coilover setup that is truly adjustable. You can adjust the uh, the high speed compression and the low speed compression. So whether you're going through whoops really, really fast or whether you're just going through a cornering motion, you can control how much dampening is gonna be going on on both of those. So it actually does cover a coilover set in the front, a coilover set in the rear, and it also comes with BDS's upper control arms to make sure that all that steering geometry is going to be in play. Now, I am interested to see if um, the CV axles are going to be out of whack because, once again, three and a half inches of lift, but it doesn't actually give you the drop-down bracket underneath it. 
that is what BDS is working on with that six and a half inch lift kit. And then I think they also have a four and a half inch lift kit that's gonna have some drop down brackets as well. But once again, that hasn't been unveiled just yet. Who knows, maybe they'll they'll announce that at SEMA show next week. So there you go. Guys, um, I, I appreciate you guys watching this video. Hopefully you were able to learn something. Hopefully this was helpful to you guys. Uh, if you want more information, wanna to talk to Nathan or Colton about a lift kit for your Bronco, we'd be honored to help you. But once again, these, these videos are never intended to sell you. We just simply want to try and teach you something, entertain you a little bit. And if you decide that you want to choose us for your custom work, man, we'd be honored to help you. And the phone number is right there on the screen. Uh, I want to repeat and remind you guys one more time that every dollar you spend on tccustoms.com gets you an extra entry into our Bronco giveaway. And that thing is absolutely epic. I am so excited about that giveaway and I cannot wait to show you guys uh, the final winner on that. So head over to tccustoms.com. Use the link down below if you want to go ahead and enter into that contest. Guys, thank you so much for watching this video. If you haven't already done so, subscribe to the channel with that bell notification turned on so you don't miss a single video. Peace.